Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be going over this play carrier and pack setup. Now, if you guys are looking for a system to run for a long Milsim event or a long Airsoft game day, I think you're gonna be quite impressed with what this whole system has to offer. But before I go over everything, I'm just gonna to have to say that it was sent to me by One Tigress. They wanted me to review the product and go over everything. And so I will be uh, pointing out the critiques that I have about it and also all the pros. I think you guys are gonna be quite impressed with everything that this comes with and how it all functions and works. Uh, it is quite an awesome setup. But with that out of the way, let's get into the video. So we're gonna go over the system now and the basis of it is their One Tigress FYR Tactical Play Carrier. Now this is a super nice play carrier. It has a lot of modern functionality that you see with a lot of the newer play carriers out there. Namely, it has the quick release buckles up at the top and the quick release straps here on the side. If you guys have never had quick release straps on the side of your play carriers, this is game changer. It makes everything so much easier to use. Just being able to quickly unlock and unhoister your uh, play carrier is so nice in the middle of an airsoft game or airsoft field uh, you don't have to deal with the velcro and trying to get things properly adjusted once you get it sized into fit this will always fit right once you get these quick releases in this play carrier does come in all, obviously a different camo patterns and stuff this is just the standard multi-cam pattern one of the awesome features it has is, is a removable front placard system here where you can swap out different types of loadout. It is super easy to take it off. You just gotta clip, unclip these here and you can just peel it off from the front of the vest. And you can see it also has a tactical fanny pack attached. So this can be a certain loadout. I can have another one, stick it on here, clip it in, and that's a different loadout. So it is a super modular plate carrier system. And then one of the coolest spots is right up here at the top is a awesome admin pouch that actually fits in just perfectly. And this is where I usually store my phone or a map if I'm needing to uh, access something really quick and easy. You can zip it up and get quick access to it. I did install a one to two point sling conversion kit that goes through the shoulder straps. And then I bought separately a tactical fanny pack because I like to be able to carry extra batteries and cameras. And on the side here, I added a mag pouches here three of them once i can carry an extra mag or two and then at the back i usually stick a radio and this runs up into the front where i have a push to talk so moving on to the back this is the akilois tactical backpack hoping i'm saying that right it is a little weird but this is one of the coolest features that really will make uh, your milsom events go a lot better it's got a front pouch here where you can store different tools or whatever you need it has a, another pouch up here at the top. You can store more things. And then you have the main big compartment here at the back. Now, in here I have my hydration pack. It does have the little hole here at the back so you can run a hydration tube through to the front. Hydration obviously is very important if you're going to those longer Milsom events. And then there's even more space in there. And then down at the bottom, there's also this big old retention strap here. And now what you can do with this is you can take your helmet off stick it in here and then clip it in place with the backpack itself. It's a great way to store your helmet on those longer form airsoft games where you just don't need it at that point. You know, you're sitting down, it's just a great way to do it. The thing that gets me with this backpack that I think is actually really game changer is this zipper system on here. It is a quick release backpack. So when you're out at the airsoft field and you've been carrying all your weight and stuff and then you're like, you get told you're gonna have to go do an engagement or if you're getting tired of carrying your water around for a little bit and you just want to set it down at base camp. When you take your plate carry off, you can just quickly unzip the pack like that. And then it is done. You can put it to the side and then you can continue on with a much lighter chest rig and plate carrier system. It is even something that one of your squad mates can do in the middle of the game just to help you quickly get it off. So yeah, this pack is super nice. And what is also really cool is it does come with shoulder straps. So if you do want to run it separately, even if you want to go hiking and use it, it is something that you can also do these clip on pretty easily to the back of this uh, backpack here. So it is definitely a multiversal backpack. So I definitely recommend checking this out because you can even stick these on different 
Um, plate carriers and vests because it is a removable quick release system. It is not something that is locked and tied to this vest. You can actually take it off, put it on whatever plate carrier you have. Now there are a few cons to this whole system. It is not perfect. I will say I hope with future additions they, they make some of these tweaks. Um, but for one, I would like a version of the pack that fits flush with the play carrier because when you are running this, it does hang quite a bit lower than the actual play carrier, which to me can be a little bit annoying. It's not a huge deal, especially considering how much you can actually carry. Another thing I did notice after just a little bit of use is it does start to fray quite a bit. Uh, the hydration pack that I had actually ripped off one of the Camelback holder tubes here on the side of the play carrier. Other than that, it is not too bad. It was super comfortable, comfortable to run. It felt really nice and secure and tight. Everything like the shoulder straps weren't too bad. Didn't have it digging into my traps after a long day. And so I was impressed with all that, but there are just those two little things that I did notice. So I would keep that in mind. If you guys are looking to pick something like this up, make sure you head over to the description and click on those links and it'll take you right to all of these products. That brings us to the end of the video and review. I hope you guys did enjoy it and that you found a couple things here that you might wanna adjust your play carrier system or pick up a few of these things to help improve your loadout, especially if you're gonna go to a longer day airsoft event or even a weekend long Milsom event. Check out the link in the description. Thanks to One Tigress for sending this stuff to me so that way I could review it and then actually find a better way to run up my own hydration and pack system for when I go to my next Milsom event. I do appreciate it. So, but that out of the way, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys in the next one.